In case you missed it, newlyweds Catherine McPhee and husband David Foster welcomed a baby boy to their family last month. His name is Rennie David Foster. The star revealed on Today with Jenna and Hoda, she explained, We picked Rennie because I'd actually been in labor for a while and we didn't have a name picked out. We had a couple names, but my husband was on a text chain with his sisters and one of his sisters suggested an old family name. It was his great-grandfather's name, his great-uncle's name, so it has a long history in his family. Her boy may be in for a strict upbringing. McPhee, who's got a lot of child-rearing experience under her belt as a former babysitter, told USA Today that, as a mother, hopefully, and as a nanny, I tend to follow the rules and try to keep a schedule. For his part, Foster, who is 71, has an additional five children, ranging between 38 and 50 years old from previous marriages. The musician told People in 2020, I missed a lot because I didn't raise them. The new mom has recently opened up about her post-baby body, sharing an image of herself wearing a brown bikini on her Instagram stories just five weeks after giving birth. Alongside the photo, courtesy of ET, the Smash actor wrote, Loving my curves because my baby gave them to me. McPhee says she's been lucky when it comes to postpartum R&R. The Scorpion alum told USA Today that Rennie is a really good sleeper so far, so I'm keeping my fingers crossed. But he's making motherhood a little bit easier for a new mom, I will say. Her bikini shot isn't the first time McPhee has opened up about her post-baby body. Speaking to People earlier this month, she admitted, I thought I would have this pressure to bounce back, but I've just been so grateful and happy that I've had a healthy baby and I felt really good, emotionally and physically. The actress had previously spoken freely about being extra conscious about her body while shooting a TV show, Pregnant. She dished, I felt I looked more pregnant than I actually did, so I definitely was holding a purse a certain way to cover myself. But Poe's baby? McPhee is in no rush to drop any extra weight. As she told People, I'm so happy that I don't have this crazy pressure yet to fit into whatever jeans I have in my closet. I don't even think about them right now. In my everyday life, I would have an event coming up or need to work out, and it's just really nice to have a break and be happy where I am. In some ways, Catherine McPhee has been preparing mentally and physically for how pregnancy changed her body for a long time. In 2017, the actress talked to Health about the importance of self-care. The actress explained, I break every rule. I'm gonna have the appetizer, the entree, some of your entree, and dessert. Just because I love food. I stopped weighing myself and doing calories a long time ago. I find the second I start fluctuating is when I say I can't have something. It's just not good for me. Loving her body wasn't always natural to the actress. McPhee once admitted to ABC News, Low self-esteem was huge for me. I was always the pretty little girl who was stupid. That was really difficult. The country comfort star worked hard, with exercise regimens and therapy, to get to a place where she felt comfortable in her own skin. McPhee has also been meditating, at least since 2013 when she talked to WebMD about her wellness routine. These days, she spreads the love. In 2019, her stepdaughter, Erin Foster, told Parade that McPhee's dedication to self-care was an inspiration to her. Foster gushed, Catherine is really good about knowing the right thing, like the right facial or the right workout that's new. She's really on top of the wellness game. Check out one of our newest videos right here! Plus, even more list videos about your favorite celebrities are coming soon. Subscribe to our YouTube channel and hit the bell so you don't miss a single one.